Change the dynamic of this offense. Anchored by a strong run game. In this game, he's the workhorse for this offense. Maybe the best running back that isn't getting a whole lot of national attention. He leads the SEC. Here's the pass out. Guy, we got to find someone else to, to get some of those runs and break some of those that wear and tear up for carry on. Johnson taking the direct snap on third and one. And he will blitz his way right. Run blockers on the football team. Now they line up Johnson as a receiver and bring him into the backfield. And they'll flip it to Eli Stove. And he's going to get caught behind the line of scrimmage. And Johnson. Did him on second down, coming back for the catches, Davis, and he explodes into the secondary. The nice cut around the 35. Right off the jump. Johnson, a trophy winner at quarterback for Louisville. Stove with the catch. On third and ten, Stidham. Drops it off underneath Johnson. State here with a lot on the line for Auburn at 6-2. and two. Still in the chase in the SEC West as well as an outside shot. This is Johnson. A lot of Texas A. Johnson lurking. Spying on the quarterback and he chases him down. Not bad, 28 touchdowns. He's got to get a convincing win. Iowa State today, we'll see how that goes. What a job that Iowa State has done so far. And Eli Stove gets another touch out to the It's a oh, great no. picture. Offense number three. Ten yard penalty from the spot of the foul. First down. Stidham in trouble. Wrapped up. And down he goes again. Sacks already for the team that is best at it in the Southeastern Conference. Johnson stuffed right at the line and a setting up the screen for Johnson. Breaks a tackle in the backfield. Gets back to the initial line of scrimmage. Running back. Auburn playing without Cameron Petway today. Now with an injury. And out of the backfield, it's Chandler Cox. Our State, Daryl Stewart Jr. There with the touchdown. Beth? Thank you, Adnan. Quick weeks, no timetable yet on Petway's return. On first down, another big run right up the middle. With He's done a nice job of really making that contact and hit. He's the first guy into the hole again. First and ten from just across midfield. Play action. Stidham. Out of the pocket, fires it downfield, and the catch is made inside. Three, Davis, he's the one. Still the one that gets the ball two throughout this game. The pitch to Martin, and he's got the first down. Here for Auburn on first down. On the ground, Johnson patient. Switch the playoff committee would have to consider if it were to come down to that discussion at the end of the year. Petway. The delay and jets down inside the... John Johnson never misses that kind of hole. Boy, after the run game was stagnant, that first... Stidham, the quick release, Hastings down inside the five. Lot to the left. Johnson, right up the middle. This is where the quarterback could be a factor, too, in the run game. The fake, Johnson open in the flat, touchdown. Yeah, they've won eight straight, has the West. Of course, Alabama with three in a row. The record, nine rushes for 36 yards now for carry on. He's going to get it again, and he'll bull Kind of mentality when he gets to the perimeter. And the run game has been such a staple for Auburn of late. Stidham has the time with the deep ball incomplete. That was but he has to toss around. Stidham looked like he had a problem with the snap. 
Five guys coming. They've got Stidham boxed in. And they'll take him down at the... This is even, even Steven between the both. The quarterbacks will be the most important keys in that football game. Whoever comes out big will be the winner. Pass drop. Johnson is offset, picks up a nice block, Stidham going deep, and he overthrows it. Zero. Third and ten, and it's fourth down. Texas A&M has seized the momentum in this one. They try the reverse with Eli Stowe, who started out the game ten for ten with a touchdown pass. Back to carry on Johnson. Dances to the outside, and that'll move. The He's got to find a way to answer with that last score by Texas a &M. Johnson will get the call again. Puts his shoulder. 58 yards now on the day for carry on, who's working without the injured Cameron Petway this afternoon. Play action. Stidham looking for Slayton, and he hauls it in at the 15-yard line and into the end. We're going to direct snap it here to open up the second half right to carry on Johnson. Ten. He'll roll out Stidham here and it's dropped. Against the five man pressure, the catch right at the yard to gain and strip loose and Hubenak who has appeared in a couple of games, so uncertainty as to who will come back on the next time they have the football. A receiver screen here for Eli Stove. Breaking tackles and ankles and down to the 35. Tackle, when you're in that point, that's Carper, the true freshman, missing it. Stidham on the keeper. He's got a first down inside the... He's probably the best blocker in the SEC from the backfield. Johnson hit by Watts in the back. Another receiver screen for Stowe. Good block by Slayton down to the five. Sit him on the move. Touchdown! Carry on Johnson met in the backfield. Did some good work. You needed that kick to get out of the zone, making it too easy for Auburn right now. Play action from Stidham, looking for Slayton, got behind the DB and holds it in at the five. A little bit off the receiver, give yourself a chance. Johnson puts that head down and rumbles. And put some of this smoke out with this Auburn offense. Carry on Johnson into the next level. And I feed, though. The defense has to feed off of it. Always special to wear that number 12 jersey here at AM. and m Up 22 here in the second half. And then the quick strike for the Aggies. But right back to work for Johnson. Chandler Cox in motion. And he'll lead the way for Johnson. Hurdles over one guy. On second and seven. Stidham. Has the time. Looking deep again. Overthrows. With Stidham. Crossing underneath is Ryan Davis. Taking turns. Running these precision routes. Johnson cannot get the corner middle in their leading tackler this season. Stidham through the hands of Hay Just did get him off the field. Johnson on the draw. And the Aggies were there to sniff it out. There it's Stidham. Look for a heavy dose now of Perrion Johnson in, in the backfield. Just nine yards shy of a hundred for the day, and he may have got it right. By any question, so again, you got to trust your senior. Here is Johnson again, and Armani Watts, Hall chip, and a possible playoff bid if you're Auburn. 
Stidham's gonna go for Slayton, and there should be a flag there, and there is. Pass interference, number 10 of the defense, 15 yard penalty, automatic first down. This afternoon for Stidham. And Stidham will keep diving. Johnson, nice hole right up the middle. First down is perhaps keep that clock rolling. Johnson, nice bounce across midfield. Look at the strength of carry on. Down at the 34, he got his back. Put a tight end in the backfield to help block for him. Johnson picks up second and eight. Aggies in desperate need of a stop. Still within striking distance. Ryan Davis. Stidham buying some time. The throwback, the one-handed grab by Johnson. First down to the 20-yard line. What a play by that's just out of breath if you're an Auburn fan. Cam Martin is in a tailback. Five-yard line, and driving it down the field, and grinding it out. A big if. But they'd like to have that chance leaving A&M today. Martin knows where he is and follows him up. Chandler Cox out there, too, to help out. Instead, it's stalled, looking for the edge, diving for the pylon. And now the Tigers will try and finish off the final three minutes here. They might not even realize what position he is. The fullback is a dying breed <laughs> in today's football, but I'll tell you what, so... Comes a wildcat, Beth, trying to secure this game. Johnson will keep. I think it's going to be a great matchup. Pass to the college football playoff. We'll roll. As we work our way into the final minute and a half, it's Cam Martin. Three touchdown passes today for Stidham. We'll continue to grind it out in the final. And the hope's still alive in the SEC and in the playoff race.